Oh yeah, the guy that stole the Mona Lisa? He really did just walk in and just take it. Not even kidding, that is, that is pretty much exactly how it happened. You see, as I said before, the Mona Lisa was never really a very famous painting. Its claim to fame really only happened in the year 1911 after it was stolen by this guy, Vincero Perugia. He was a former employee of the Louvre, and the way that he stole the painting was he just simply waited until it was about to close, hid in a closet, and then came out that next morning when the Louvre was closed. He then simply walked up to the painting, took it, broke it out of its case, and stuffed it under his apron. His plan was almost foiled by something stupid, though. The door that he tried to escape out of ended up being locked, and so he decided that he was going to break the doorknob and get out. An employee of the Louvre found him, but thought that he was just another employee that was stuck inside and helped him get the door open. He then literally walked out with the painting. This then set the art media world on fire, and it is that specific thing that is the reason why the painting is famous today.